Hi, I'm Mike Connolly, Superintendent of CCSD 21, and I want to welcome everybody to March, uh, the month where spring officially begins, although we've had a little bit of teasing of spring weather throughout February. I personally am looking forward to the days getting longer, uh, the weather getting better, and being able to get outside a little bit more, as I'm sure our students are as well. Um, we have a lot of things to celebrate this month that I want to share with everybody. Uh, starting off with our District Spelling Bee. Now this is an event that really has just grown over the past several years and we really want to honor the 250 students across the district that took part in the Spelling Bee. Um, this is not a requirement of our students. This is th these are students who have decided that they want to put themselves into competition. Um, so again, 250 students across the district uh, competed. And the top 27 um, of those students were invited to the district office um, to have a district-wide spelling bee. And um, it was a great competition. And we're really, really proud of Will C., who is an eighth grader at Cooper, um, that won uh, the District 21 Spelling Bee. And he will be moving to a regional competition um, in the Scripps uh, National Spelling Bee system. So. Uh, Best of luck to you, Will, and just a, a great job uh, in, in winning this year's Spelling Bee here in District 21. We also want to celebrate um, some of our staff uh, who have been recognized uh, by the Illinois State Board of Education in their Those Who Excel Honors Program. Uh, we are just really, really proud of all of our staff that, that have um, this year won uh, this honor and in past years have won the honor as well. Um, and this year, our ELSP team from London Middle School, uh, that's Abby Pillow, uh, Jamie Steinke, uh, and Brenda Thiessen, um, are being honored. Uh, and also, our school psychologist from Tarkington, uh, Jerry Holtmeyer, um, is uh, being honored. And so later this spring, uh, they'll be invited to a banquet in their honor and across the state. Um, uh, other uh, those who excel winners uh, down in Bloomington um, and they'll have the opportunity to be celebrated amongst um, their peers across the state for just the great work um, that they have done uh, in our district. Also uh, want to congratulate Cooper's Jazz Band One uh, on taking home the top honors uh, from the Jazz in the Meadows uh, competition uh, that took place at Rolling Meadows High School uh, in late February. Um, again, if you've ever heard uh, our, uh, any of our performing music groups across the district, uh, they are just a group of fantastic musicians, and so we're really proud of the Cooper Jazz Band um, for taking home those, those top honors in that, that event. Now, uh, this is the, the time of year where uh, the state of Illinois has the Five Essentials Survey, which is a culture and climate survey um, that we really value getting information from parents on. Now, we, each school needs to have 20% of its parents complete um, uh, the survey in order for the results to be reported. And so right now, uh, we're a little low in participation in some of our schools. And so just encourage, uh, if you have a few moments, to complete that Five Essentials survey. And you can uh, get more information on where to find that survey, either through your school office or on our district website. Uh, later this month, uh, we are going to be doing our second um, school safety week uh, where we will be having a series of uh, preparedness drills um, for all of the different types of events that we, uh, we practice every year, fire, um, uh, any kind of lockdown, um, you know, relocation drills, um, things of that nature. So again, um, look for more information coming from your individual school buildings. Um, but this is something that we started doing back in the fall and really wanting to have the entire district uh, and all of our schools participating in these different types of drills um, at, at the same period of time so that we can really make sure that we're doing everything uh, we can to uh, ensure that our schools are as safe as, as possible for, from the unknown. So that'll be coming up March 20th through the 22nd. And again, more information will be coming uh, from your individual schools. So again, I hope everybody has a wonderful March. Um, this is the, uh, we're just a couple weeks away from spring break, which will be very well deserved. And uh, we'll see you again in April. Thanks.